What up UP, we're at Baker Park in Calgary, Alberta and we're gonna do a course review and come along with us. Wicked hat. <laughs> Par 3, 297. Tight little gap here, the ender. Looks pretty fun. Looks like, that looks tricky, honestly. I don't know, I don't think it's an ace run like hole two, but. What'd you I, think of the first two holes? First, first, second hole ace run is kind of wild. Just having an ace run second hole. First hole, uh, it's not too bad, actually. It seems pretty open, same kind of line so far. We'll see, see if it gets a little more technical in the back. Hole four. Uh, we're looking at 210 feet. Uh, really short hole. Um, I don't like that you come out of hole three and you're in the middle of the fairway on hole four. That's just asking for trouble, but that's all right. We'll see how it goes. There was a sign back there that said this way, okay. but, but it's still so kind of... You're coming out like right in the middle. You're throwing there and you're walking out there. So yeah. I think that could, that could lead to trouble. So we got the Prodigy disc baskets. You know, they're not bad, kind of shit. I don't like Prodigy, I like Innova. I like the disc catchers. These, man, like, so we've, many spit outs. We've had too many spit outs. Too many spit outs, these baskets actually suck. But you know what, this is a pretty new basket. Yeah. Which is good. Yeah, new baskets, but just should've got Innova. <laughs> Okay, hole six, 204, par three, you see it. Trees, dude, tree central. It's like almost hole five in Sparwood. Hole five in Sparwood is probably a little harder. Cause this one you actually got an alleyway, but dude, you hit one of these trees, you're in the shits left or right. And almost. there's too many trees to hit, too many branches. Hard pretty, hole, fun hole. Pretty picturesque though. It is pretty picturesque. It is beautiful with the sun blinding. Par three, 210 feet, hole eight. It's a, it's a fun little forehand, backhand. You got some some big birch trees to get in your way, and uh, yeah, it's a pretty wicked hole, I think. Throwing a feet in here. Too much hyzer. Uh, too much hyzer, too much hyzer. It's a fun hole, though. Probably ace runner. Okay, Wyatt, give us a little review on hole 10 here. First, back nine. Hole 10, first hole the back nine. Um, just a short hyzer shot, right? Um, not too hard, but you put it deep, like you put it 10 feet past the basket, you're not hitting that putt. Yeah. I just put it, like, I was literally 10 feet and I had no putt. It's so. But I kind of like that, those greens, where you have to like leave it short. Yeah. I like it, but good hole. Yeah. Hole 13. <laughs> <laughs> It was a good hole. Uh, just a short little forehand hole. I like the, the kind of a picture. It is nice. It's kind of dangerous back too, the OB. Yeah. I, this this course is a lot of short, like somewhat technical holes, and I really like it. It's, it's definitely, I see why it's the most played course in like Canada, because it's very beginner friendly. Like very beginner friendly. The foot traffic through here too, like so many people. Oh, it's crazy. It's insane. So, that those you, guys are to? you uh, you finish hole 14, and then you have to walk across the path to get to hole 15. Right there, there's another basket right there for another hole. Yeah, this, this part of the course is very crowded. Yeah. It's, uh, you're asking for it to get hit out here. Especially being the busiest course in all of Canada. Yeah. It could be dangerous. It's crazy. That's okay though. Yeah. Still beauty, still beauty.
That was a tough hole. Uh, that was the first 400 foot hole in the course. It's like 415. Yeah. Par three. Uh, tight line. Like your jail on the right. Like I threw like my max distance forehand, which is like 350. Still had a long ways in. Yeah, that was uh, tough. Good hole though. It's nice to see some diversity on this course. Okay, Baker Park course review. So we just finished 18. Honestly, it's a pretty fun course. We You have to come here super early though. Like it's 11 a.m. and there's pretty much people on every tee. And especially on these back four holes, dude, it was busy, it seems kind of dangerous. So the back, back four could use some work. Fun tees, fun lines, a little bit of forehand, a little bit of backhand, you know. What's your rating out of 10? Uh, out of 10? Mm, since it's too busy, Fun little holes. I'll, I'll give it like a 7-8. Seven, 7-8? Eight. Seven, eight. Seven, eight so like far. 7-8. Like almost an 8. So. I like that. Yeah. I will give this course a solid 7. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, that's, it's, not, it's not bad, but it, there's some... There's a reason it's the busiest course in Canada. Yeah, like, it's really beginner friendly. Yeah, that's basically the only reason. <laughs> like, subscribe, stay tuned for the next course review.